Hi everybody, I'm back. I'm Kevin Lee and I am with the incredible, amazing Johnny Vino, the super talented. It's so good to be hosting you and having you today. Um, let's see where everybody's from in our chat. So we have, hello everybody. Hi Val, Matheus, Eric. Where is everybody from? Please tell us in the chat. Uh, but yeah, like it's super great to have you. And um, today we have a fun field week for you guys. Um, you saw me with Andrea Hawk and Daniel White. And uh, so that's tomorrow. They're gonna be uh, continuing their app. And then 11 a.m. from 1 p.m. We'll have Chris Cannon with Howard Pinsky. And then again, we'll be together reunited tomorrow at 1 p.m. Me and Johnny Vino, yes. So yeah, hello from Norway, Morocco, Missouri, Mike, Lindsay, hello, hello, Agata, Poland, that's awesome. Wow, we have like a whole <laughs> world watching us right now. Yeah, that's great. No pressure. <laughs> um, awesome, so if you guys have not known, we are having a daily creative challenge. Uh, to view the challenge, you can go to uh, the challenge tab on the um, chat. And today's challenge is a uh, interface or a website for a musician. So if you wanna see how to submit, just click on the challenge tab, submit your stuff, and then me and Johnny Vino can give you some feedback. But all right, it was, that's it. And you gotta introduce yourself. So your stuff, first of all, I gotta say, your stuff on Behance is amazing. You're super talented. Um, so tell us about yourself and where you're from and what you do. And I know a lot of people are here like wanting to know uh, more about you, so. Yeah, I'm from like a small village called Athapikulam. So okay. it's a small village in India. Nice. Uh, so I studied like engineering, but I really passionate about design. Uh -huh. uh, so I thought of like, uh, doing like a design exercise for me. Uh, yeah. So I did like every day one prototype. Okay. So I did like two years continuously. So I made nice. like 500 prototypes. Wow. Uh, so that's my background. I just love design and yeah. just do something like creative or crazy ideas. Cool. And what are you going to be doing uh, for us today or this uh, week? Um, today I'm going to plan like a small, like a payment app. Like you can send money to your friends or like a family. Yeah. Because I usually send money to my family. Nice, uh, yeah. Uh, or they send me. And tomorrow I'm going to talk about like a voice interface because I seen like a lot of home hubs like portal or like so many voice interfaces are coming. It's like the future. Yeah. yeah. So I thought of making some UI, how we can make a UI. It's awesome. For that. Cool. Uh, and yeah. then, um, yeah. So today it's kind of like a new structure where you'll be kind of like doing a teaching moment for everybody here yeah. on how to do micro interactions for yeah. the payment app like you mentioned. Uh, so did you want to like talk more about that or get started on what we'll be doing today? Yeah, Is we can exciting? get started because we, it's cool. time. Yeah. yeah, awesome. Cool. Let's get to it. Yeah. So uh, you are opening the Adobe XD app and then on chat, oh, Usama said, I know about Johnny, he's my favorite designer. What do you have to say to that? Yeah. You have so much love. Thanks for everyone. Munir <laughs> says, John Vino can create three apps in three days. Three apps in three days. I can believe that, yep. I've seen his work. Super talented. Uh, cool, so it looks like you have the um, iPhone X. Yeah, I, I nice. started with iPhone X. Uh, Our board? Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh, so I also have like assets I'm going to use, okay. uh, basic asset, so I don't need to spend time in creating those. Um, you have everything planned out, super yeah. creative. Uh, so the main thing I usually do, like when, this one I learned this year uh, from one of mm -hmm. my friends, like the main thing when we are starting a design, we ah. have to like follow like a certain like a rule. Okay. Then we can break a rule. So that's what I usually do. Yeah. Uh, so. Like that. Yeah. So. I use like a guide guide. It's like a cool plugin. Uh -huh. uh, um, and actually, you guys, speaking of guide guide, 
stick with us and make sure to log in because uh, for today's chat and win that's coming pretty soon, um, you the winner gets a year subscription of the plugin guide guide for Adobe XD. So stick with us, do not leave, please don't leave me. And we will get to that uh, when the time comes, so. Cool. Yep. So the first thing is like, that is these are like basic guidelines I always. Oh, so that up. is guide guide. Yeah, this is right guide now. guide. Yeah. So you can just put like, I use like a basic margin, mm -hmm. uh, like a 16 pixel from right hand side, left hand side, uh, from bottom, like since we have like a, like a small bar. Yeah. So I give like 34, this I give like 88. So these are like a basic guideline. So once you set up, mm -hmm. so you are in like oh. a screen in, instead of like a... Super customizable yeah. grid and... Yeah. yeah. Because most of them like forgot we will cross the grid. It will in... Uh, it's hard to like m to be in the grid. Right. Um, so I'm going to just like put on like a basic title. So this is like iVoice title. Mm -hmm. For the uh, payment app? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, nice. So I'm going to start... Uh, laying out the artboard first. That's mm -hmm. a. I already did the wireframe in home, so I'm going. I know how what I'm going to do. So I'm going to just arrange the artboard. What are the screens going to come? Okay. Uh, so first screen, I'm. This is like a basic home screen. Then I'm going to. Okay, this screen going to be. You're going to select people. And it's really nice that you're naming the artboards. So yeah, organized. that's super important. Super, yeah. Because after some time, when we are doing prototype, it will be like crazy. Oh, screen one is going to screen two, screen three. Is yeah, <laughs> right? <laughs> well, now, um, actually, Adobe XD has a filtering and search option for their new update. Yeah. So if you want to, like, look at all items, like, you can search each artboard once you have a bunch of artboards. And it's easier to filter out and find a specific artboard you're looking for, hmm, which is cool. a great update. It also search for the layers, right? Yeah, and, like, that's shapes and stuff, like that, not just, yeah. That's really cool. That's awesome. Uh, so you have a home, a select, people, money, and purpose. Artboard, nice. Um, so this is how I lay out the screen. So, you know, this is like a wireframe. Yeah. So you know what we are going to do. Nice. Um, so I'm going to just start like a basic. Um, mm -hmm. Uh, we can put like a small name or like because whenever you go to finance app you know like there will be so many graphs and stuff I, yeah. I really don't like that because no one, likes <laughs> no one like no one has time for that no one likes that yeah yeah it's like a crazy graphs but yeah. we can start with like really like welcoming message yeah like in the top super like, personal friendly yeah. welcoming um, I know you like to use the hand wave a lot like saying yeah. hello yeah. yeah yeah I love that <laughs> It's like your signature. <laughs> yeah. You know? This design was by Johnny Vino. Hi. <laughs> um. Nice. So um, you're actually gonna be doing a micro interaction. Yeah, yeah the, Once everything's like structured. Yeah. yeah. Very cool. Uh, although this is going to be like a long screen in terms of UX. Yeah. But I'm primarily focusing on micro interaction. How we can? What are the different things we can do in Adobe XD? Wow. Because I feel like really happy because it's Adobe XD is really improved like than the last year. Mm -hmm. So we have added so many features. Why can't just show those features? So that's what I'm going to do now. Wow. Cool. Um, so if you want to send the money instead of like giving like a usually people think of like a okay put a small like a box like a button like send receive so why can't we do something like creative that's how I think yes uh, because whenever you start doing something creative people will be like why why not but I know but that's how you have to be like Whenever you are starting, you have to be like super creative. Yeah. Then if it does not work out, we can like go back. Well, the thing is, I know we talked about this before. Um, are you, did you mm. go to school for UX UI design or how did you like first learn about this um, uh, field and stuff? Yeah, that's that's super interesting because I not studied it, design. Oh, you didn't study yeah. it? Wow. So that's why that's my awesome. mind is like super creative. Like I'm like a kid. Like when we born as a kid, we do so many things. Yeah, yeah. Right? It'll be crazy. <laughs> uh huh. 
because we, we don't know any rules or like guidelines like restriction right, right. so that's how i feel that's my advantage i feel uh, because i'm not into some mindset because i'm Avoid more restricted yeah. yeah i'm like more open why can't we try this why can't we try that yeah. can we do that i'm so like, self taught this yeah self taught like that's awesome yeah especially of like all the hype and awesome uh, fans that you have on the hands fans yeah i feel in your work that's awesome yeah i feel i'm happy like people are like supporting me initial days the point is like really good like when i started like a lot of people supported me that's that's like a really big thing right so the design community since you're um, like a self taught designer mm. um pranjal is asking if you can please say something about uh whenever you have a uh, creative block like what do you do creative block yeah creative block when you're just like oh my god i have no ideas like um you're not as creative as you were and like you're trying to like get that back like what do you do to kind of get that like uh like i'm going to be more creative again yeah i think that's that's some of i got like when we uh so what i usually do is like like I just read like random things. Oh wow. You know what I mean? Like I look at <laughs> <laughs> This may wow. sound crazy but Okay. But I feel like history have so many things like every 100 year is like a repetitive it's a loop. So Oh really? Yeah, it's it's we stuck in like a technology we go for like inspiration insights but if you wow. go back and see a history you learn like so many inspiration. Uh-huh. Also you get you search for I use like ans like whatever like image platform to look like images just like wow. how people are interacting in real world <gasps> how people use like physical object so oh wow so not really like design really but just like yeah completely yeah books wow that's Compl- a different twist yeah i'm not i don't read books because i I'm, i'm not read person but i see <laughs> things like yeah. i just You're crawl a visual through person. Yeah. yeah so i just crawl through what other things like world happen completely different so it will give you like like a creative idea it's it will change you dustin goes johnny doesn't get creative blocks <laughs> you're just creative in general no i'm not creative like i did <laughs> i did a lot of dumb stuff but cool yeah awesome and uh, if you guys are just joining us right now make sure to submit some challenge submissions uh we the challenge is basically designing a interface or website for a musician so let's make musician? sure to submit What was that? It's for musician, that's cool. Yeah, like ooh, I wonder which musicians you guys are going to choose. Yeah. And uh I am here today with Johnny Vino and he is designing a payment app where he's going to be teaching us how to do micro interactions on Adobe XD um using the animation tool. So we're just getting started. Yeah. Super exciting stuff. Yeah, let me Yes, Val. Thank you. Check out the challenge tab for more details. Yes. Challenge tab. I'm so glad we have these moderators cuz I'm like, I'm new here. Okay. And everyone's helping, mm. which is awesome. Yeah. And with an amazing talented designer. So. <laughs> cool. So what do we have so far? Uh, so I'm thinking of something like instead of a button, I'm thinking of like how come like we can drag this blue to like center? Okay. To send money. <gasps> Like if you want to send money, you have to drag the blue. So the interaction of yeah. dragging that. Yeah, it's nice. like, it's like if you're giving a money, like you know, like if you have a ca- cash, you yeah. give money like this. Oh, you know that's what I mean? interesting. So you're using that human interaction. Yeah, it's like with the same. And like when you're counting a money, there will be like a dragging. <gasps> that's cool. Yeah. So if you just that's relate awesome. those things, like you will be great. Yeah. Wow, it's I love how you incorporated both of that. um you know face to face interaction with a human giving money to each other with an app interaction yeah with your fingers which is cool because yeah. if you use like a normal like everyday life like interaction it's easy mm-hmm. for everyone to understand yeah uh, and it's good to design familiarity yeah with the user nice uh so i'll give a gray give like a little bit bluish background or like grayish mm mm-hmm. uh, Let's give it a little bit border. Four, five. Very little bit we can highlight. Um, nice. Okay. 
so i'm thinking of Sorry. like a uh-huh. showing like a people near you because when i go go for a restaurant with my friends yeah so they ask me oh could you send me money like <laughs> They just like play now. Yeah, they, you, oh, can you just give me money? Could you give me money <laughs> to pay for this meal? Yeah. Um so I am like yeah. searching for their name. Oh, what's your name? What is your username? Could you send me that? Why for, can't like, we other apps? Yeah, yeah, why can't we use like a Bluetooth like really basic stuff? Wow. Yeah, so it's that pain point of, you know, that whole the step process of finding usernames, sending the money where you can just quickly just like air kind of like airdrop yeah or like bluetooth send money quickly yeah it's like a share it or what are like apps nice. uh, i also like great on it shows like a wave so, um so oh anaeus asks johnny what are the skills that an interaction designer should have interaction designers should have mm-hmm. what are some skills do you think i think main think the first we have to understand what is interaction because most of them think interaction is just animation or making I thought that too <laughs> when I yeah because I, I also said oh we have to do animation but it's not animation yeah interaction designers if you if you think about like everyday interaction how you are opening a door yeah how you are like opening a fridge or like or how you send money yeah send yeah. money like how you are behaving in a real world mm-hmm. so if you are like more aware of that like we'll be an interaction designer but if you think in a perspective okay i'm going to do a beautiful animation it will fly like this yeah that's <laughs> i like that, that explanation yeah, yeah. that will not bring you like a really good place so and it's not just animating people. yeah it's not animation <laughs> so that's what my parents think like oh johnny is doing it <laughs> <laughs> you're like no i'm doing something no. completely different yeah also the cool uh, plugin i have like so many plugins uh because I love plugins. No. Oh, that's awesome. See? Well, how look how quick that was. See, this oh, is like it will take m- me like 1 hour to put all the image and mask. Wow. Uh, and if you guys are still with us, make sure to log in um and stick with us for another couple minutes because we're going to be having our chat and win and we will the winner will be getting a yearly subscription of the Adobe XD plugin guide guide. So, make sure to stick with us and log into your account. Hmm. Very cool. Also, the cool thing I really like doing it is like showing a progress. I feel that's really important. Yeah, like process and progress is super important especially like on your portfolio. Yeah. Um and Speaking of like portfolios and stuff, uh you said that you were still a student? Yeah, I'm studying uh at school now. Um getting your uh, uh, masters I believe. Yeah, yeah, said? masters in interaction awesome. design. Wow, yeah. that's so cool. Yeah. I know I just graduated too so I'm like oh, like it's just weird not going to school, but that's awesome. You graduated in graphic design or graphic design yeah it's cool but um i think it's awesome you're getting your masters in interaction that's so yeah. cool so what is all this stuff all these um, this one yeah uh, on the top of the artboard other uh, than the back key like yeah this is things? back key the, this is like a status like how many screens you have yeah. because we are going to have like a four screen okay so it's good to like let users know okay how many steps you are going to go through Oh okay. because sometimes yeah. it's like form like go infinitely because people get bored. Mm-hmm. It's just to inform them, okay, you are going to do only 3 steps. Like I'm almost done. Yeah, yeah. I'm almost done. Cool. And you feel like this is four screen but when when we do micro interaction you will see the magic like it goes like in seconds. Wow. So I'm just splitting all the like a big chunks of screen into like small small chunks. That's cool. You know what I mean? Yeah. Instead of giving everything in a single screen, people get confused. It's They'll like be too like, much. "What?" Yeah. yeah. What? <laughs> uh, nice. Oh, so Pretty asked, like, which plugin was that when you um, had all those photos? Yeah, that's a plugin called Fill User Image. Oh, nice. I know it's awesome how there's so many plugins in Adobe XD. Yeah. Plugins so is cool. 
I feel plugin change my like whole workflow because I become super fast. <laughs> you know, when I mock up or like wireframe something, it's super fast to do yeah. using all the plugin, all the grid, like in grid, like guide guide. It's like one second. I can create so all quick, the, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, and Carlos, uh, if you guys are just joining us, we are with Johnny Vino and he is making a payment app that uh, to show us how to do like some micro interactions and using the animation tool. So he's uh, basically starting out all the structures and assets adding to the artboards. Yeah. And at the end, he'll show us what he can do with yeah. some micro interactions. And make sure to stick with us and log into your accounts because Chet and Win will be coming up later today. And you guys can win a year subscription of Guide Guide, which is a plugin for Adobe XD. And we are currently using it now. And I love it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, here it is. So, there you go. How, how, what inspired you to take? You were like a hairstyle. Who is <laughs> my hairstyle? Yeah. Um. You know, just like myself, man. You know what I mean? Oh. Like, I just felt like, you know what? Today's like a bun day. Okay. And I just felt like <laughs> it was just calling my name today. You know? Okay. Yeah. Why do you like it? Yeah, it's really cool. Thank you. You should do it too. Yeah, I'm going to. That's why I'm growing my hair. Oh, nice. You're going to do a bun too? Yeah. <gasps> we'll see. Cool. Well, that's. I love that. We're going to be bun buddies. Yeah. <laughs> we should see. Um, I'm we just. We should like, be like, what other hairstyles do you want us to have? <laughs> Let it's us a competition. Know. A fun bun day, Ryan says. Ryan's a sumo bun. Yes, a big sumo bun. Uh, Warrior's bun. Yes, Val. <laughs> cool. Oh, so what did you just do there? You um, I put made a like text a, box. Yeah. This one is like sometimes you go to app. Uh -huh. Like the main main call, main like uh, feature of this app is to send money. But they put a form like really small, like like this. It's so tiny, right? Yeah, it's the like I can't click. I'm like, I don't care. I, I want to box really big. Yeah. That's you don't want to squint your eyes and be like, I yeah. can't see like. Yeah, why can't we make it big? Yeah. Because that's the main purpose of it. Yeah. yeah. You're sending money, but. So I'm going to put like a small slider because I love sliding. Nice. I love sliding than like a, using a keyboard, you know? Yeah, it's so much quicker. Yeah, it's somewhat fun to me. Uh, okay. Maybe I'm sending $100 to my friend. Jessica. Yeah. Can we be friends so you can send me $103? Yeah, yeah, I can okay. send you. Okay, perfect. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I think we pretty much are friends with our, if we're going to have the same hairstyle. Yeah. So. Cool. So the blue circle is this um Yeah, for adjustment. sliding. Nice. That's cool. It's, because some people like to slide, but I'm not sure about like Gen X or like baby boomers. Like they don't, they like to like type, you know. I love how you <laughs> <laughs> went through like each generation. So uh, do you think millennials are like a more... Yeah, millennials person? like to like sli swipe, <laughs> slide. What about Gen Z? Voice activation? Voice activation. <laughs> Send 100 rupees. We can do it tomorrow, maybe. Oh my god, we should make like a <laughs> funny thing where each generation what the um, what they use most, like the yeah. feature of something. I'm oh, doing. Oh, interesting. Yeah. So you're putting the numbers below. Yeah. So that we can do that cool animation. Oh. <laughs> I'm excited. Yeah. The, you know the, sometimes whenever I start like. Because creating design is like not fun, but when we do micro interaction, it'll be like awesome. Yeah, because you can see how it'll actually yeah. look like when, yeah. It's not just screen. Uh, I'm going to mask all the numbers. Nice. Uh, where is my number? 
So it, it actually shows, instead of showing a length of number, it will show. Oh. So when you animate it, they'll mm. all like pop up. Yeah, it will like, the... yeah. Cool. Because it shows like this, I'm going to mask. Yes, so chat and win is in a few minutes. So if you are just joining us, make sure to log in and chat it up once chat and win starts so you can win a one year subscription of uh, the Adobe XD plugin guide guide that we're currently using. Hmm. So stick with us for just a little bit more. Also, when I start <laughs> like, uh, like a design, I don't go like super UI. Mm -hmm. So all these are like wireframe. I'm laying out. I'm not applied to UI. Okay. Yeah, I'm just laying out how it's going to look. I mean, it looks great so far. No, this is not looking great. I mean, <laughs> I'm just excited for the micro interactions that yeah. you're going to have. That's the real thing, yeah. you know? That's like really yeah. cool. Today I'm just focusing on like micro interaction. Yeah. You know the cool thing I learned in like shadows? Like I make like 13 and like 26. Oh, the drop shadows? Yeah, drop shadows. You're a drop shadow guy too? Yeah. Yes, <laughs> thank you. But thank I you. want the drop shadow to be like really minimal. So I see it's, it not look like drop shadow, but mm -hmm. I want the drop shadow. Nice. Uh, so Cindy is asking, uh, she likes the typeface you're using. What's the typeface called? Typeface, that's my, it's circular. Circular? Yeah. Ooh, nice. Uh, so this one, circular. Uh, nice. Johnny Sloth. <laughs> okay, you guys, it's finally Chet and Win. Um, the fireworks are behind us. Wow. <laughs> Who made that like, crazy? Hey. Ooh, oh, we're fireworks too. Uh, so you guys chat it up and uh, we'll be right back uh, to see who's going to be the winner of chat and win. So. Keep chatting, you guys. Hey. You got this. We are back. So, say hello to Johnny. Tell him how he needs to have my haircut by next show. <laughs> um, but yeah, keep on chatting. We have Alexander. Um, Ale oh, you're the same person. It's going by so quick. Uh, Carlos, Bima, Mike, Cindy, Thess, Bohana, Manuel. Who is it going to be, Val? I don't know, but I'm excited. Aaron. Oh my god, all these people. Steve, who is going to win the one year subscription to Guide Guide? Adobe XD plugin. Felipe, Bohana, David, Steve, Moj, who is it going to be? Oh my god, are you feeling this tension right now? Yeah. And it is Pranjal hey. Sharma. Woo! Congratulations! You won one year subscription of Guide Guide, mm. uh, the Adobe XD plugin. So I like the cool awesome. font there. It's like a oh this. It's like pixel. Yeah, it's like a. It's like a video game. Yeah, Mario. Mario. <laughs> <laughs> it's a me. <laughs> um, yeah, congratulations. And we will contact you uh, on Behance. But on Behance, okay. Cool. So what do we have so far? Um, I'm kind of doing something. Uh, this one we are drawing in. We mm -hmm. are selecting a person. We are going to slide in. I'm kind of thinking like, if I'm sending a letter because in, in like sixties or fifties people yeah. used to send letter like a money like a letter right. So I'm. Oh yeah. Like written yeah. letter. I had to like think about it for a second. You're <laughs> like right yeah. You know the letter right. Oh yeah. 
<laughs> I know, Leonard. Yeah, no, you don't do it. You had like so many. Yeah. yeah. Okay. It's just so I'm thinking while. of like, okay, we are going to select a purpose. We are going to put that in a letter and send to that person. Oh, that's cute. I yeah. like that. So the, again, that same interaction. Yeah. On a mobile screen. Yeah. Nice. And as you guys are just joining us today, um, I am with Johnny Vino and he is making a payment app where he is going to be teaching us how to do some micro interactions uh, and interaction design with the animation tool in Adobe XD. Uh, and he's also using the Adobe XD plugin guide guide uh, to manipulate and create uh, customizational uh, guides and grids for his artboards. And make sure to submit your challenge submission deadline, um, which is coming up in about like 55 minutes. So submit all your submissions. Uh, today's challenge is creating a website or interface for a musician. And me and Johnny will give our best feedback for you. Yeah. This guy you want your feedback from because he is awesome. So make you sure to somebody. submit your submissions. Okay, I'm going to... Cool, so you put the present icon on um, one of the options of why you're sending the money? Yeah. Cool. Um, maybe gift. Movie. You go for the movies, right? Oh, yeah. What movies do you like? Movies? What genre? I like science fiction. Oh, like sci-fi? Yeah. Yeah. I like like horror, horror comedy ones, but what's the most recent movie you've seen? Isn't that a hard question? Like you forget sometimes. Yeah, I like the, like I don't remember the recent movie, but I like the movie called Ro Ready Player One. Oh, I haven't seen that. That's it's like a the, VR game. Yeah. That's like really cool. Was it good? Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. Nice. Also, I watched a movie called Searching when I'm in flight. Oh, really? So the Searching movie is like, they just search for a, like a lost daughter and using only using screen. There is no like a real. Whoa. Like a that's screen. Interesting. Oh, nice. So sorry, I'm searching. <laughs> I'm typing searching here. Okay. And it looks like uh, the autocorrect feature helped you out there too, right? Yeah, it's that's so, so cool. I, I love that. I'm like, I'm like the spelling person. I make so much. Me too. Mistake. And I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> just like it just goes downhill <laughs> once after like grammar school. It's like, oops. Uh, Val says sci-fi. You say yes. Yes, sci-fi. Sci Sci-fi to give you interaction, creativity. <laughs> Do you like Star Wars? <laughs> yeah, I love Star, Star Wars. Wars. Nice. <laughs> Dustin says he loves Ready Player One. I have not seen that. I need to see that. Yeah. But so awesome. good. You know when like you see the movie trailers mm -hmm. and you say, oh, I'm going to definitely watch that. But then you forget about it in yeah. like six months. And then a friend of yours just mentions it, like you did. Yeah. And it's like, oh, yeah, I have to watch that. Yeah, some movie we really love, we don't watch. I know. <laughs> and I'm like, what? I totally forgot. Yeah. Oh, nice. So you um, copied and pasted uh, from the other artboard. Yeah. And so uh, your friend Jessica, is it her birthday? Are we gifting it? Did no, you guys go on Jennifer. a movies? It's or not Jessica. Or not, oh, not Jessica, <laughs> Jennifer. Uh, <laughs> or is it for her tuition? Are you paying for tuition? Okay. So which one are you? Is it the gift or how are we going to give her money? I'm going to select more uh, movies for movie ticket nice. recently watched. Oh, me. cool. Um, I have some cute coins <laughs> here. Oh, I love that. So you like the emojis. Emojis. Which is awesome. I don't. I think it's a millionaire's thing. Like, <laughs> <laughs> oh, put some emojis here. Yep. 
So your target audience is millennials, you would say, for this app? Yeah, this app is surely not for Gen X and I like the name Baby Boomers. Baby Boomers. <laughs> yeah, because you know what they've been doing. Um, so, uh, yes, Val, I agree. Johnny is the greatest. And Hassan's and Johnny, haha, is amazing. Yes, I know. He is awesome. Mm, that's a lot of fun. Nice. I love the round corners instead of yeah. like the sharp ones. Because it's just so much better. Yeah. I don't know, somehow it makes it cute. Like a cuter, yeah. Yeah. Also, the cool thing is, like, since I'm using Guide Guide, I know how where I have to place, you know. Like, what is the like, nearest thing I can place? Mm hmm. I'm gonna just copy paste. I agree, Val. Johnny does has the greatest laugh ever. Like, he. It just makes you wanna laugh with you. Like, really? Yeah, because it's so happy. <laughs> <laughs> I what? love it. I I'm, love I'm it a so serious much. person. I'm serious. <laughs> you're always smart. Yeah, you're the most serious person I know. I know. That's what I'm trying to say all my friends. I'm serious, dude. Don't <laughs> <laughs> and then they hear your laugh and they're like, yeah. we love him. <laughs> awesome. Oh, so uh, just a like a quick few edits. Yeah. To make look, I think shall I go with white color or apply some crazy? Ooh, because this looks clean. But we think shall I make hmm. cool colors background? Maybe we can ask the chat. What do you guys think? Should yeah. we um, have a white, you know, text background? Yeah. For the enter amount, or should we just have that out and have it? No, the whole flow, I'm thinking it's like really plain. Mm -hmm. You know? Maybe I add some like crazy colors. Yeah, since it's yeah. for like really young people. Interesting. Yeah, let us know what you mm -hmm. guys think we should do. <laughs> so uh, the money screen will be. Like you're highlighting the second one to show that they're on the second page yeah. of the step. Cool. I don't like showing like one, two, <laughs> three. It's kind of like really lame. <laughs> <laughs> so some indication would be like cool. Nice. Whatever you want. Just tell it like it is. I also, guess. you know, sometimes I forget like, oh, which screen I am? Did I put like which money I selected? I usually forget. Uh-huh. I select like hundred dollars, then I will get a doubt. Oh, did I select a hundred dollars or thousand oh, no. dollars? Yeah, I get so nervous because it's like um, I send my sister like uh, like the cellular bill or whatever, and like mm. like did I send her like <laughs> did I put an extra zero? Yeah. Like oh no. Yeah. So cool. we can show that here. Yeah. What is amount here actually? I'm sending five hundred dollars. That's too. Damn, much. that was an expensive movie. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> It's, it's like one of those movie theaters where like you get a fancy dinner and then yeah. it's like reclining seats. Yeah, it's like, I don't think that's too much. I think that's too much. I'm going to gift her, okay? <laughs> <laughs> oh, gift her 500? Yeah, I also give a context I'm sending to her. I don't want to send anyone. Oh. <clears throat> what a great friend. <laughs> Awesome. And if you guys are just joining us, uh, make sure to submit your challenge submissions. Uh, the challenge is designing a interface and website for a musician. And at the end of the show today, me and Johnny will give you amazing, amazing feedback because he's super talented. Uh, we are with Johnny Vino and he is making a payment app where uh, he's going to be showing us how to do micro interactions and using the animation tool. Uh, so it'd be very cool, fun stuff. So, yeah. Also, you see one thing like all the app, like throughout the app, I use like only two fonts. Okay. 
it, so I th- think that's good though. Yeah, that like, that's a cool thing. Like people will forget. I usually like copy. Okay, here I use seventeen. Seventeen is the minimum font I use. Uh huh. So I just use like two fonts. That's it. Oh, and sizes. Yeah, two ah. sizes. It will be fine. Because if you use too many fonts, it's hard to. It's just too much scaling, yeah. kind of yeah. busy. Yeah, I, get, I agree. Yeah. Yeah, cool. I make it the flow like longer because I want to show interactions. Uh huh. But it can be done in one screen. But it's cool to show like several screen, you know. Yes, I agree. Uh, okay, I'm almost. Okay. I'm well, here. that was so quick. Oh my god, you already have like so much stuff done. <laughs> Uh, okay, I that. This is fast. Oh, I feel I'm slow. Since I'm in, since I'm talking to, I'm slow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but right. I love to talk and design. You know. Yeah. That's super right fun. Good conversation. Yeah. New buddies. Um. So really quick, uh, someone asked, how to improve your design skills. How do I improve? Well, you on. Und- uh, Behance, you design every day and you submit something. Yeah, that right? that's a cool one I did. Wow. Like last, yeah, I said right. Uh, I started like two years back, I think. So I I fix like every day and night. It's yeah. like ten to twelve, night ten to twelve. I fix like the same time. So wow. every day I practice some design. So that's I'm cool. I made like five hundred design. But if you think my design, there will be f- that's awesome. Three fifty design, which is not like great. But mm-hmm. you have to make like so many bad design to become a good designer. You can't be a good designer like just like, like that. Just like yeah. that. You have to make so many bad design. You have to be like open. Man, five hundred design. That's like you're like design goals. Like, yeah. That's awesome. So if you make like thousand four hundred like bad design, one day you'll become a good designer. And you have to improve that. That's a cool one thing. Mm-hmm. When I post in Behance or like whatever medium, people give you comments mm-hmm. like. So it will encourage you to be. Some people are like really critical. Wow. That will encourage you to like. Okay, every day I have to improve this thing. Yeah. Awesome. Instead of making your same mistake again and again, you have to improve yourself. Very very cool. Cool. Uh, this one. So, Anthony, uh, this is, uh, we're actually currently doing the uh, micro interactions and animations that Johnny Vino is teaching us. Uh, but the usual UI UX design uh, process is, you know, research and planning and doing notes and stuff like that. So yeah. Yeah. This is just one part of the whole process. Yeah. Because a lot of people, I thought of showing all the process because it's cool to show. The final, the cool yeah, stuff. Final, yeah, final cool stuff. <laughs> Nice. But this is like an end of like any... This will be end of your design process. Yeah. You can... But also the cool thing, you know, like I always start with like prototyping. Like oh, I do... Really? Like, yeah, I do, I do research, basic research, yeah. like maybe like one or two weeks. Mm-hmm. But then I will go directly to prototyping. Oh, cool. Yeah, that's yeah. why you can like quickly make prototype in like Adobe XT. That's what I love like about the whole process of um, UX is like there's no right way. Yeah, it's know? like yeah, some to people like solution. they go by UI, wireframe, UI, prototype. Right, right. But I go in like reverse manner. I I do research, then oh. I do prototype. Mhm. Like then I will test with people like using like mobile if you have XT you can show in like mobile. Yeah, like whatever gets you the best solution for yeah. the pain point. So if yeah. you see all the screen I'm doing now, this is not pixel perfect. But I know how it's going to work. Yeah, right. Once you're yeah. done how it's going to work, then you can figure out, okay, now we can sit like two hours to make it pixel perfect, you know? Yeah, awesome. Initially, if you start with pixel perfect, you can't be, you'll end up in like figuring, oh, I'm going to maintain this pixel. Munir's like, your your tips are so wise. <laughs> so wise. <laughs> you're, you're very wise, designer. Yeah, I prepared yesterday. Yes, <laughs> and then um, yes, and also Val, um, make sure to submit your challenge submissions uh, on the challenge tab for more details. Uh, the challenge is designing a website for a musician, and once you submit your submissions, me and uh, Johnny will 
give you feedback on it. That's cool. Mm -hmm. I want to get feedback from you. From me? Yeah. I want to hear your feedback <laughs> for them. Oh my gosh. You are so talented. I love this blob, you know. Uh, Hassan asks, are you a lone wolf for UX or just interaction designer or researcher? So what would you say that's like your label? Um, what my name? Like label? your uh, title, job title? Or I don't know. I, I will say just a designer. Just a designer in yeah. general? Oh, okay. I don't nice. like I don't know. I don't like this. There are UX designers, you know, like there are so many crazy like names. I know. There's like interaction designer. Um, but I would say interaction UX. designer. I would focus mainly on interaction yeah. than research part. You okay. Know? You can call me like interaction. Very cool. Um, okay. I'm less. Cool. Adding the colors and stuff. Nice. Yes. Yeah. So now we're going to start prototyping it and yeah. uh, doing the micro interactions or? Yeah, yeah, we are doing oh, micro so interactions. Cool. Awesome. So, yeah, yeah more so that's colors. all the screen. Look at that, those beautiful screens all lined up. I'm going to add some more colors to make it like really like for the Cinex kids. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. We're just getting funky with our colors. Yeah, I'm going to put so many colors too. So many, uh, there was a person on chat, they were asking, let's challenge Johnny to not use blue or something. <laughs> okay. Fine. I mean, hey, we have, what, what oh, we have? green. We have, yeah, green, we have pink, <laughs> hey. Okay, I'm going to use green. Green is also my favorite. Nice. Uh, so Suyog says, where do you look for inspiration while designing? You said you read a lot of history books. No, I don't read it. Or not read history, but you Google history. Yeah, I yeah. Google history, yeah. like images. Wow. Or black and white images. That's really cool. Nice. And yes, Eric, please submit your portfolio uh, this Thursday, um, this week for review. You, we might review your design. Cool. Okay, Looks very we can nice. go to prototyping. I'm not using blue, I think. <laughs> After that <laughs> comment, you're like, no more blue. No more blue. Lime green is what we're going Also, for. you know the crazy things in the App Store? Like 70% of the app is blue color. It's blue, yeah. you're right. Because it's somehow like, it's a comforting color. Yeah. I feel like it's very techy and yeah. um, it's calm. It's calm. Yeah. yeah, very calm. Oh. So Artem, uh, to apply for portfolio review, there will be, I believe, a link on Thursday on one of the tabs on chat where you can submit your portfolio where we will review it at the end of Thursday's episode. Where do you get these guidelines, please? Asked by Mohammed. So you are using um, the Adobe XD plugin yeah. guide, guide? Yeah, yeah. And uh, he uh, customized the grid and uh, the yeah. guides. For yeah, the so I did like, a, what is the shortcut? I cardboard. Oh. If I click Shift Alt Command G, mm -hmm. it's not coming, but it's fine. <laughs> Uh, so you can go to like guide guide and like add quick guides, you know. Mm -hmm. You could do so much more than like the yeah. actual programs. Yeah. Yeah, which is cool. So it's like really quick to use. Manipulating it. Very yeah. nice. So I usually start with guide guide because it's like super fast to do yeah. everything, you know. Super quick. Yeah. Yes, and then if you want to look for more information, Val sent a link to guideguide.me for more info. What are your favorite fonts, Suyog asks. I know you're using Circular now. Um, do you have any other favorite fonts or typefaces that you use? Favorite font? <coughs> I use 
I like San Frans. Yes, of. Yeah, that's a good one too. Yeah, that's Any like Sans a basic. Sarah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I like Google Sans. Google Sans. Google Sans. Oh, I have not seen that one. I've not seen Google Sans. It's like circular. Oh. Google Sans. I like Corp Sans. It's kind of like funny. Ooh. I'll show you. Very pretty. Cool. But I usually stick with like doing like circular. Circular? Yeah. That's like your yeah. top one? Yeah. Because I don't want... I think I'm not expert in typography, but... So I picked one good font. I know that's a good font. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, yep, this is a good one. I'm going to stick with it. Stick with that. Instead nice. of like... And Darkness uh, Sakar. Uh, this is... Uh, we are with Johnny Vino, and he is going to be teaching us how to do micro interactions uh, and using the animation tool while designing a payment app, which is awesome. You're like motivating, dude, which is awesome. What? No, you are so motiva motivational. Oh, speak. You. you got this, Johnny. Yeah, you can do it. <laughs> you can do it. Yeah. Um, if you are doing a 5K, let me know. Yeah. And I'm not going to run with you, but wear a headpiece. <laughs> and I'll be like, keep doing it. You can do it. Okay, I'm going to drag. Oh, this guy's here. So now it's a fun part, like doing interaction. Ooh. So I'm going to drag nice. this here. Okay. And so this is when um, someone wants to send money, the interaction of a person to person. Yeah, you're it's like a giving your money. money to someone yeah. and you're doing that with your finger. That's yeah, it's cool. like think about in a real world, like do you, do you like click someone, like go and click someone? Like you don't. Hey. Oh, I'm giving money. <laughs> but, oh my God, could you imagine <laughs> if that was like that? That's what like our mind is like so like into digital world. We have to think something like more physical. Yeah, yeah. Um, okay, uh, this I'm going to give time. Nice. Also the cool thing, the duration I use 0 0.9. That's like a magic number. If you put 9, nine? your oh. animation will be like super smooth. I don't know why, but... Really? Oh. Yeah. I don't know why. You're I... hearing it from here, you guys. UI, UX, life hack. <laughs> life hack. Use 9s. And we are just hitting the under the 35 minute mark to mm. submit your challenge submissions. Today's challenge submission is designing a website for a musician. So make sure to submit those by 34 minutes and 31 seconds so we can give you yeah. feedback on it. Um. Oh, so you're... I, th I, I think because of this layer, maybe that's a problem. Oh, okay. Hmm. So are you trying to... Um... Yeah, I'm trying to drag this guy. Uh-huh. No, this why this one guy is not gonna maybe. Oh, I got it. Oh, you got it? Yeah, I didn't. I had to move this, you know. Oh yeah, <laughs> for it to move there, it's I'm probably like, like just like at the same spot because it's the same screen. Yeah, I'm like what? <laughs> okay, you know, cool. sometimes you'll be like so silly mistake. I know. <laughs> it's okay. We all go through that. Yeah. Even the like senior level people yeah. probably go through that. Cool. Cool. Oh, nice. So cool. So that was like a mini little interaction there. Yeah, I'm going to put cool into action. Uh... <laughs> no, I'm going to show something like a small expand. 
Oh, nice. Uh, Anthony asks, was interactive design a difficult line of work to break into? Is it very competitive? Or are people like um, asking a lot of questions and it's, co and it's collaborative? What do you think? Mm. In the uh, field of interaction design. I don't know. Every, all the field is competitive. It is, yeah. <laughs> I feel the same way. Every yeah. field is competitive. If, if we have ice cream shop also, it's competitive. Yeah, you're right. Um, but... But it's fun. I, I yeah. feel it's like super fun to work in. I agree. Interaction. See? Whoa! That's a... Oh my god. That's a magic so you have cool. to add. So, sending money, bam. Who no. do you want to send it to? So cool. So I made like a two circle here. I put like a really small one. Make it really small. Like zero, yeah. Nice. And here I just put like a really big circle. To just like... Yeah, to just wow. like blow. And then what transition did you do for that? Uh, I just did like auto animate. It's just... And it, since I used yeah. like a magic nine, it's like really good. Yeah. Also I had to use like easy and easy out. Uh-huh. I'm also glue some this touch. And, uh, I love how it's just like it just pops up. It's yeah. so pretty. I'm gonna use this guy also, like some cool stuff. Nice. So you guys agree as well. I think XD is the easiest of all Adobe products. Yes. Yeah, so and that's basically. A better experience program so yeah. i would hope also i feel like, like it's super fast to do some prototype mm -hmm. because when you're in prototype you'll be like you're not dealing with ui but you want something like really quick and i also not do want to deal with many softwares you know yeah the rendering problem this is like super fast i know it's yeah, you you did it super quick and it's yeah. like beautiful like uh the interact the micro interactions that you're yeah. doing it's like Amazing. I'm going to just twist and so I group everything. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, and that's going to pop up too. Yeah, just I'm going to. Some like micro interaction stuff. That's so cool. I'm going to reduce the opacity to zero so that I don't see anything in the screen. Uh, cool. Did it just like do a little twist? Yeah. I just put all this layers here and I just rotate it. it. Yeah. Oh my God. Can we do that again? That was like beautiful. Yeah. Just like. So I just. Or the, just you um, prototyping one? it. Yeah. Uh, I already clicked auto animation, so it's going to animate. But this one I, I did as like, I used angle. So I directly typed angle. Nice. And I grouped everything so that I can shrink everything. And then make it small. Yeah. Cool. Very, very cool. Yeah. So it's like... It's... So why these small things are important means instead of having like a dumb like a screen, for example, we are talking, we, we have so many emotion face. It's not, okay, it's like a robot talking. You know? <laughs> there is some motion. Like, yeah. Some emotion. Yeah, something like emotion, it will provoke, like if you... Have. It should be like a smiley face, like, ooh, yeah. you sending me money. Yeah. Like, that sounds, yeah. Uh, cool. Okay, I'm done with the screen. You can go to... Auto-animate. Nice. So a lot of auto-animate um, yeah. with transitions on the prototype yeah. feature. Nice. I don't think it's auto tap here it'll go here uh so suyog asks what inspired you to start designing what in general? Like, i don't know that's i, I don't <laughs> i thought it's a uh, just one day just like you woke up you're like I'm no i'm designer. like when when i was a kid like when i'm in school kid mm -hmm. like it's on like sixth grade okay so i used to draw a lot of diagrams and send to newspapers oh wow that's uh, awesome. So illustrations and stuff? Yeah, it's like a small Mickey Mouse diagram. It's like a small <laughs> diagram. <laughs> but I don't know that it, someone is giving money for what you love to do, you know? It's oh, like yeah. you just love to do something, but they're giving like a job. Yes. 
Yes. No. I, I feel know that yeah. feeling. You, you get the feeling. That's that's very important in any job. Mhm. <laughs> Ryan says, "Can you do a drag spin like the old school <laughs> roll dial phones?" That would be cool. That's so retro. Which one? Millennials would be all over that. Millennials. I know. Are we millennials? Or? Sneaky Johnny. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> we have Michael Chase Michael here. Michael Chase. Say hi to my friends. Yes, so much. Hello, hi. hello. He is joining us. Hey, joining the stream. Hey. Doing good? Doing awesome. Okay. We are He's missing doing you. Doing awesome. Oh, I'm, I'm here. I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> He's with us. Are you playing with the new uh, auto animate? Yeah, yeah, it's really cool. He's doing the micro interactions yeah. and oh, animations. So I'm like, yeah. I'm like amazed. Like. What? Look at that. Look at that. It flips. Oh, yeah. It rotates. <laughs> what the heck? I love it so much. It's like so awesome. Much. But yeah. And if you guys are just joining us, uh, we are with Johnny Vino. He's making a payment app where uh, he is teaching us how to do micro interactions and uh, using the auto animate tool on the prototype section of Adobe XD. So. Awesome. And we have 25 minutes, 26 minutes left for challenge submissions. So make sure to uh, submit your challenge submissions, which is designing a uh, website for a musician. So me and Johnny can uh, give you amazing feedback for it. Yeah, so. I remember like last time I did like a music, music app. It's not for a musician. Yes, yeah. Michael, yes. It's fun. I love music. Uh, okay, I'm going to repeat the same like animation to all the screen. Ryan says, "LOL, these two. If they were in a laughing match, oh <laughs> my god, oh my word." Yes, we are obsessed with Johnny's laugh and his positivity and his amazing vibes. It's like so much. It's contagious. So uh, explain what you're doing now. Uh, uh, I'm just sorry. like using the same like animation. When did you do that? <laughs> <laughs> That's so cool. Oh my god. This one I did like a cool thing is like. So what you did was the same making a small circle. Yeah, small okay. circle. But the cool thing is like I put the small circle in the left corner. So it's feel like it's coming from the. Like a direction. Yeah, it's yeah. like. That's cool. Whoa. You know. All these like cool little micro interactions, like it yeah. really gives it personality and changes the look and feel of the app, especially during transition. Yeah. Cool. Well, so you keep saying, I love it. Something I don't want to animate. Sometimes I don't want to animate. I put some random names. Oh, for like a little like label being like, yeah. don't animate this. Yeah. Nice. Okay, I'm going to do this cool interaction. Christoph says, we all know Jennifer ain't got no $500 on her bank account. <laughs> but no, that's why he's sending her $500. Because <laughs> he's like, I'll help you. He's a really good friend. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to use this cool. Ryan says, he reminds me of a friend of mine, long lost twin. Well... Your hmm. twins right here, Ryan. Just have to come over. Uh, I'm going to drag this guy. Oh, I mean. <laughs> this is the main event. <laughs> Ooh, very cool. Just that little swipe feature. Yeah. How love us that. millennials love to do it. <laughs> you know the. <clears throat> Ooh! Some crazy things are going on. I don't even know. Damn. No wonder <laughs> Jennifer looks so shook in her profile picture. She's like, $500? What? Whoa. So uh, I'm gonna select Jennifer. Okay. This one I'm gonna. Oh, you gotta animate Jennifer? Yeah. No, I'm not gonna animate or, Jennifer. Uh, yeah, Dad. just the transition. Yeah. Nice. Easy and easy and easy out. I wish I could be Jennifer too, Hassan. Oh, 
We all wish we could be Jennifer right now. Cool. Thanks. All these cool micro interactions. Mm. So this idea, I mm -hmm. can see. Oh, the male to yeah. see which one. Uh huh. Uh. This one I want. This guy. We are finally on the last step of the four step process. I think that's so nice that you have four steps for this because mm -mm. the less steps a user takes, I feel, is um, the better yeah. to complete something from the product. Yeah. yeah. Super quick, easy. Nice. Uh, this one, maybe come from here. This is oh, like an envelope, so it's, it's kind of like close yeah. together. <gasps> That's so cool. Uh, I'm going to put this guy. I'm going to duplicate this card so that I can animate. Animate the gift the option? Card, yeah. The gift option, I want to like come down. Oh, okay. But I want to still maintain that card there. Okay, cool. Um, so when I click the the card will come here. Cool. Oh, it's so cute. <laughs> it's like we're, we're sending you a little gift yeah. to your mail. I don't. <laughs> Munir's like, thank you, Johnny, <laughs> for your generosity for paying him uh, five hundred dollars. Yeah, I'm a... to each of us. I'll Everyone? be waiting. I'll be waiting for send, my check. Send, send. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'll be waiting for my notification after the show. Yeah. So no, I'm just kidding. And we are coming up to 20 minutes, you guys. 20 minutes to submit your minutes. challenge submission uh, deadline. So get those rolling. We will give you amazing feedback. The challenge is to design a, uh, a website for a musician, which is cool. Yeah. Very cool. That's really cool. Cool. Pablo's like, this is so sick. I know. These little things really change. Where is my this guy? Oh, here. Yeah. Your interaction with an app. Oh, so that's gonna come down to seal the gift. Yeah. Nice. Oh, so um, Mitchell mm. is actually uh, asking, how do you do that with the numbers that go so fast? The numbers? Yeah, like really quickly. Do you wanna? Yeah, I can show. Like I use like. If you're typing a number, yeah. so you have to arrange like one, two, three, four like this. Mm -hmm. And then you have to put like a small rectangle. That's the same color? Yeah, it's uh -huh. it's the same color. As the lime green. Yeah, then you have to select all, the, for example, see this, all the layers. Awesome. And then you put like a small rectangle. This is my rectangle mask. Okay, yep. And I select all the layers and I clicked mask with shape. Mask repeat. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. And then once you did that, you are to you are going to copy paste the same thing here the numbers, but here I mo will move down what number I want. Okay. No. Yeah. I want to give five hundred, so I give five hundred. So you make it to five yeah. zero zero. But once you've done that, you have to move this like like round. Yeah, because you have to swipe. Yeah. It. Yeah. And the cool thing is, like once you select the round and. The circle. Uh -huh. Yeah, the circle. And uh, if I give like a drag option, mm -hmm. trigger drag, and uh, click on easy and easy out. So the trigger is the drag. Yeah, if yeah. I drag, we are saying like, okay, if I drag, move this numbers. Oh, nice. Yeah. Cool. So it's automatically move all the things. And you got it. Yeah. Look at that. Look how quick it goes. Yeah. Boom, boom. Nice. And I like how the color changes too. Yeah, the, the color yeah. changes too. That's awesome. Okay, this one. Thank you for joining us, Daniel. I am enjoying my company with Johnny Vino as well. Um, so Johnny, yes, tell us more as like you're uh, doing more micro animations, a little bit more about yourself. Myself? Yeah, either it be like design or um, 
people just want to hear your story. Like my story. Like, Hello, Jeannie. How's it going? Uh, so good to have you here. <laughs> I think my story. Yeah. So maybe you said you were born in India. Yeah, maybe I uh -huh. tell this story. I I okay. thought of like, yeah. initially I thought of become like a player. So I I play volleyball. Oh, know? nice. So that's cool. So I thought of become a volleyball player one day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How did that but go I, for you? But it went well. But nice. After like high school, I think I had to go concentrate on studies. Okay. So I had to leave that. But the things I learned in volleyball, it's it helped me in design because in volleyball, mm -hmm. uh -huh. like whatever game or sports, you practice the whole year to play one game, uh -huh. like the finals. Yeah. So that's why I see a design. Like I practice every day. Like mm -hmm. in volleyball, I wake up like every day six, oh, and practice like good. up to eight, wow. and every day evening I practice four to six. Wow. You know the pr the mindset of practicing and making mistake and mm -hmm. learning from it. Mm -hmm. That I learned from like sports. And then would you say like a final project at a job is like the final game? Yeah, it's like a final game. Wow. It's like a, if That's you think, a very good perspective to look at. Like, yeah, if you think everything is a game, you, it will be fun. You know, life will be fun. Nice. Because in game, the main thing is people don't care making mistakes in game. Yeah. They make so many mistakes and they just learn from people. That's very true. So do you also design on the weekends or is that like your break time? To no. Like breathe? No. <laughs> no break. You have no break? Yeah, that's what I think. I have to take a break. Got some well. But I don't think this is leisure. like a this is like exercise. It's not like a work for me, you know. It's like a fun. It's a lifestyle. Yeah, it's like a Wow. That's awesome. Yeah. Wait. It's like it's not a diet, it's a lifestyle. Yeah. It's not, if you love doing that, it will not be a big deal for you. Mm -hmm. Okay, I cool. think so I made let's everything. See what we have. I put like a small interaction, we'll see. I hope it will work. Uh, okay, easy. In. Okay, cool. Okay. Yes. So Keep we're sending her 500. Uh, we wanna, ooh. <gasps> Damn, that was good. What? Did it do like a like a lock screen, like a little lock animation? Oh no, that was the oh that was the gift. Yeah, that was cool. I think this guy is not moving properly. It's fine. And then all you did was move the uh, objects to yeah. where you want it to be animated. Yeah, I don't play with any timeline or whatever. I just move. Okay. And then what uh, trigger did you use for those? I just used like time. Wow. So here I use like time. Without delay, just go like this. Very cool. Yeah, it's like an auto. For all of these artboards, yeah. the orange ones. Yeah. Nice. And, and that's just how easy it is. You yeah. just have to move the objects and shapes to where you want it to be. And if you want it to disappear, you just delete all the objects and have a trigger uh, transition of time. Yeah, that's what I like. like I'm not playing with any timeline because mm -hmm. I started with After Effects. You need to play with timelines. Like yeah. it's hard. It's yeah, yeah, my brain work in this way. Okay, outboard, move here, move that way. Mm -hmm. So that's super easy for me. And I love how like super smooth the rendering time yeah. is. The transition for everything. Yeah. Awesome. You have some fans in Colombia from Carlos. Colombia, cool. They say we love you. Yes, Ryan, I agree. Adobe has harnessed the power of time. <laughs> Super smooth. Cool. Very cool. Very well, though. How much time we have? Uh, we have like third. Well, we actually have a lot of time. Cool. So, um, yeah, we'll just show the micro interactions of the wow. Not too many things. Large <laughs> circles. Oh, very cool. I think too many things are moving. So this is sometimes you have to be cautious, you know? Okay. Oh, too much interaction? Yeah, it's You're like, like, whoa. 
people don't even know that's that's a limit we have to like know the limit yeah know? if we put so many things well, let's see how many should we count how much uh when you play it i think this screens are fine uh huh this is yeah, like one interaction one. oh yeah one this is one interaction two and this is interaction and this thing is so many oh that so many part <laughs> you're like whoa this is like crazy <laughs> Yeah. So cool. yeah, we have to So let's maybe we'll like see what we can do um to fix that. Yeah, I think I know what's happening. Okay. This way. Uh Daniel, I wish I had Adobe Live on a smart TV. If everyone has one, that way I can watch this. Computer is okay. I know that um if you have an Apple TV, you can AirPlay it. from your laptop if you have a Mac to um watch that or just a HDMI cord to hmm life hacks Ryan says haha can the envelope flap just animate folding over instead of dropping down uh folding That's over That's an interesting huh I'm like trying to like visualize Yeah I got like do that? it's the 3D thing right Yeah it's like wow that'd be interesting Yeah I think the envelope is too much we have to <laughs> Hassan made it super clear. Are you okay with the blue mail on the orange background? That's <laughs> Okay. I don't know why people hate blue. <laughs> I think it's cuz uh okay. you, you do you like do you use blue a lot? Yeah, I use only blue. There's nothing wrong with blue. I like blue too. I want to maintain the branding. <laughs> oh. Okay. See, he tricked you guys. He used a different shade of blue now. Yeah, it's a so blue. So it actually still it's yeah. a blue. <laughs> it looks good though. I like it. Yeah, I really like this dark and like light contrast. Yeah. But um, always it will be contrast. like contrast. Johnny, you can do it. You are the master, Ryan. Yes, he is. And if you guys are just joining us, we are with Johnny Vino. Um and he's an interaction designer designing a payment app and teaching us how to do micro interactions using the auto animate tool on Adobe XD. And we have 10 minutes left you guys to uh for you guys to submit your challenge submissions so we can review your submissions and give feedback which is uh a website for a musician. So Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Oh, people the black are is still not good. Halloween, stuff, Halloween color. Blue. <laughs> Halloween. Yeah. I think it's a oh, Halloween. Halloween, <laughs> yeah. Um here's money for Halloween candy. Yeah, it's a But Halloween. This is adult trick or treating. Yeah. This is adult trick or treating. Yeah, it's like when you're in Halloween, it'll the apple look like Halloween. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> when you're in Christmas, it'll be another color. When Black yeah. Friday, it will be black. Oh yeah, that's that's a good idea. Yeah. So it's seasonal. It's a seasonal app. Yeah, it's a seasonal app. Instead of always seeing a white color. Yeah. Uh, what this guy's doing? Hmm. <laughs> Jason says now it feels like Jennifer is blackmailing. <laughs> <laughs> with the black mail thing. Oh, black mailing. That's a Oh. That's like a different take on an app name. Yeah. Do we have an app name for this? I don't know. Guess ask someone like what app name. Yeah, for maybe this Halloween. Uh think of some, you know, app names in uh the rest of the time that we have. Also tagline. A tagline too. Yeah. The hello And yes, Val, 8 minutes left until the challenge deadline. So get in your submissions so we can give you feedback on what you submitted, which is the website for a musician with the amazing Johnny Vino. Why all this it's ending with amazing Johnny Vino? Because you are so amazing. <laughs> It wouldn't be the same instead of saying Johnny Vino because You're super talented. 
Hmm. Someone says, <laughs> name it, show me the money. <laughs> show me the money. Instead of cash app, make it coins app with Jamal. Who said that? Oh, Vlad said he has to wake up in five hours, but he can't stop admiring your uh, interactions. Hmm. You are so talented, he says. Johnny, give up. I don't give money. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I'm going to give. Yeah, this is not a real app. Yeah. Guys. <laughs> Uh, we wish he would. Johnny Cash. That's funny. Nice. So let's see. Ooh, that's very clean. I like how it's the gift is kind of like getting sealed inside yeah. and making it smaller. Did you want to talk about your process of doing that? Uh, which one? of the, the whole interaction of making the gift smaller and then having the envelope close on it. Yeah, this is like, since I, as I said, like I want to send something like a letter. Mm -hmm. It's not just money. Yeah. I guess money is like a tool, like if you put some amount you're sending, but what is emotion we are provoking? Mm -hmm. So I thought of like adding a letter. So this, if I click this card, so this card will shrink down and go below. And this like envelope, it's coming from like a bottom. So I copied the same envelope in previous screen. See? Yeah. This screen. Oh, okay. So it's behind it. Yeah, it's it's behind it, and it's opacity zero. Yeah. Oh, then it's gonna transition. Yeah, it's like it feels like it's coming from like bottom. A fade. Yeah. Nice. And this card is going here to here. Mm -hmm. And for this envelope, I have this envelope here. Oh, in the previous screen. Zero opacity. Yeah. And then it becomes See? 100 opacity. Yeah, it's like it here. Yeah. Nice. And you use time transition? Yeah, it's like a just time transition. It's cool. like super fast. Wow, I think so... my mouse. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> my mouse is. Okay. That's super cool, you know, the time transition. I love time transition. Yeah. And you guys, we have five more minutes for you guys to submit your challenge submissions. Uh, to receive feedback from uh, Johnny Vino. Oh, so do you think you'll have a micro interaction um, at the last one? Yeah, that one I'm planning something cute. I'm going to send like small money. It's like going from you to her. Oh, like like a loading yeah. thing? Yeah, oh, it's not a cool. loading, but I'm thinking oh. like, okay, w one by one. Oh. Okay, I'll I'll show you how I can do it. Wow, it's 4 a.m. in India, Suyong. 4 a.m.? That's And awesome. he's still watching this. That's dedication. That's so Pure loud. dedication. Yeah, I'm happy that people from India, it's like they really support me. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, because you're from there. Yeah. That's but awesome. They are like really loving. Is UXUI big in India as well? Yeah, everyone is like really... I feel in India, people are like really into design, like they want to design. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, it's gonna, it's it's cool. Is it kind of like a different approach to UX UI, would, would you say, compared to like America or in New York? Yeah, I feel, uh, yeah, in India, like we love to do colors, like, because it's so colorful, India is. Oh, okay. So. Because yeah, that's more familiar. Yeah, it's like. Yeah. yeah, we love to have like some colors, brightness, like something Ooh. like really happy. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Uh, yeah, New York. New York is like different. Different means like we want to be clean, black and white, mm -hmm. like direct to the point. Wow. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, and yeah. then um, Ryan says, haha, the coin should flip across. Well, funny that you mentioned that. Uh, the new update, you can flip. flip. Yeah, you can flip objects, you can flip shapes or anything. Oh, really? Yeah. Um, horizontally, no, and vertically, yeah. It's super cool. Hmm. I don't know for sure horizontally, but yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> Munir, you are a global designer, Johnny. Yes, he is. And we are running in about
about two and a half minutes. So let's get as much submissions as we can so we can review them with Johnny Vino. Uh, we are very excited to see what you guys have all designed today. Hmm. So it's just a mobile app or like it's a... Um, I, I believe it's a website for a musician. Hmm. Um, so I wonder what musicians they chose. Yeah. <laughs> Nice, so you... I'm thinking of something like giving a coin one by one. Oh, cool. So if it feels like you're losing money, it's fine. She's like, give me that money. <laughs> Thank you. Nice. We can flip through. I don't know how to do that. Oh, to flip an object? Yeah. Um, so if you click... Are you trying to, what, what are you trying to flip? Uh, wait a second, I move this. This coins, mm -hmm. if I want to flip. So if you want to flip these coins, mm. I believe there's an option to do that right here. So oh, you this could, one? You, yeah, you can flip this. Oh. Yeah. Oh, you're like thinking of something <laughs> else. No. no, I thought like something, <laughs> three dimensional. Oh yeah. <laughs> no, but like, yeah, but flipping cool. feature cool. Um, is awesome. The new update also has a, um, cloud future where yeah. you can you know upload your files with coworkers and uh yeah i really love that you know yeah the cloud feature there's gonna be like more uh future um features with the yeah. cloud so yeah, yeah. sometimes We're i just introducing it sometimes awesome. i feel like oh if i lose my design file what i can do now everything is in the cloud yep and it auto saves it yeah So if you actually um, like like have your mouse like stop for a little bit, mm. it should save it. If um, oh, but I don't know if this is under the cloud. But no, this is in a computer. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's okay. But yeah. Oh, let's see what we have so far. So I made all the like a screens. We'll see how it's going to work. Yeah, let's do the micro interactions for that. And in a couple of seconds or minutes, we will be uh, looking at everyone's challenge submissions. So, hmm. yeah. So, um, are you just doing some touch-ups? Yeah, I'm just cleaning up. I'm almost done. Very cool. <laughs> Someone is already doing a countdown for us. That's a deadline, folks. 10, 8, 9. <laughs> Hassan is super active. I selected. Oh yeah, so let's see what you have so far, just to see a brief overview. Cool, I can start from first. Nice. Um, the first, yeah. I'm dragging in, I'm selecting Jennifer, I know. Oh. Oh. I'm gonna nice, do 500. Lucky Jennifer. And I'm gonna say, okay, this is what it's a gift. gift. What? That's so cool. Yeah. The coin. <gasps> oh, the coin. Was it supposed to like <laughs> be in the background? Like. Yeah, it had to go like this. Okay, we can clean it up. It's not a big deal. Wow. Super cool. Awesome. Oh, you're doing uh, something super quick? Uh, yeah. Ooh. Cool. Nice. What are you selecting? 
Oh yeah. Cool. Okay. Yeah, we can look through. Yeah. The. I can give a break. The break. Yes. So, this is Cam Beadler's landing page. Um, for the uh, website for an artist. Mm -hmm. So this is pretty cool. I wonder if there's any. Oh, you can go to a different PDF. I like they created a logo. Like it's a. Yeah. So I like how you know he has his name bolded, a huge hero image. Do you have mm. any other feedback for him as far as um, UX UI design? Uh, yeah, I really like the logo, mm -hmm. and I think the name can be in the, near the logo or something. Oh, like so that. a little bit more higher. Yeah. Right here. Uh, yeah, super clean. Um, yeah, maybe add some like since it's a, like a music show, maybe something like a video would be cool. Yeah. Because like the experience, video? like when they come to this website, they feel like oh, it's a music website. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Very cool. Nice. Yeah. Uh, so let's see another. This one is, I believe, um, Hassan's. Mm -hmm. DJ Paco, best DJ ever. Nice. <laughs> oh wait, I just got that. <laughs> best DJ ever. <laughs> I don't know Paco DJs what. So I like this because mm. um, I like EDM, but that's All just right. me. I have no like bias to that. Uh, but what do you think about it? Yeah, I think the, I like the concept, like overlaying the image, it's cool. Maybe something like the typography of like best DJ ever can be like something more. Where is he? Where is DJ Paco performing? Yeah. June 27th. Nice. <laughs> well, we're all going to go and see him, DJ, uh, at a music yeah, festival. So. But it's really cool. Like they show all the events. Oh, wait. So someone's telling me I can scroll. Oh, it's scroll? It's letting me scroll up. Hmm. Yeah, it's not letting me scroll for some reason. It's got stuck. <laughs> you can scroll. Huh. Yeah, it's not letting me scroll. But it looks good. Just wish I could scroll through it. Mm -hmm. Into a song. Okay, well, let's look at the next one. So this one's from Karina Chang. Mm. Oh, she has a cool video. Oh, it's a prototype. Oh, wow, nice. people are so quick to. I know, like what? It's an oh, HD. the interaction is super the, smooth. Yeah. To change the image. Nice. Rex Orange County. I like how it's like there's the grid structure on the bottom, the yeah. image that fills up the screen. Mm -hmm. Wow. What do you think? Yeah, I think... Uh... Oh, wait, there's more. Oh, there's more? Oh, I think it's like screenshots of like what you did. Uh, what other feedback would you say? I like how like when you hover over something, it turns like to the buy tickets, like it turns orange. You could favorite. Yeah, I think the, the font, <clears throat> I really like the card, can be the font, the description, mm -hmm. like a uh, San Jones Laneway Festival 29, whatever. Mm -hmm. It can be like more like bigger. Oh, the St. Jones right here? Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of No, the of... description. Down oh, the there. description. Oh, yeah. 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 Maybe something like icon they can use, like, okay, this is a location, this is a time. Maybe mm -hmm. like splitting everything. Yeah. Instead of like a description. Because whenever I see a long description, I don't read. Mm -hmm. Maybe like a small icon and like a content. How do you feel about the placement of the nav on the website? Yeah, it's cool. Maybe the icon can be uh, the logo. Mm -hmm. It's like too much, really big. It can be a little bit smaller. I like the colors. It's really cool. Yeah, it's like a like a children's party. Yeah, it's like, like, yeah. Maybe they can make it like really bigger so that header will be like really small. Uh huh. Nice. Yeah, other than that, it's cool. Very cool. Oh, it looks super fun. Like their concerts with like a yeah. bunch of balloons. Awesome. 
Uh, let's see. This is Beck Nelson's. Um, I don't know if it submitted. It's a blank design, clean design. <laughs> wow, very clean, minimalistic. Great Super job. clean. Uh, maybe someone else is. They're still working on it. Maybe it's not loading. It's. Let's see. Hmm, I'm refreshing all of these to see. Yeah, everyone is did amazing. Yeah. Um, I think how quick they made that's like really awesome. Like how yeah, how quickly they did it. Yeah. It's just incredible. Yeah. Oh, we have another DJ wow. Paco. <laughs> DJ Paco website. Um, awesome. DJ Sam. He's <laughs> <laughs> from Chennai. Wow, that's like intense. DJ Sam, DJ Avenue, DJ Nick. <gasps> Everyone is DJ. Wow. How do you feel about this? Like you can, they kind of used your same structure of the the uh, highlighting which page they're on. Yeah. Um, and then like a card format, I believe, mm -hmm. with the, or not a card format, the buttons are with a drop shadow. Yeah, I think, yeah, I like this because it's like clearly show which time. Uh -huh. And like a buy tickets button. Nice. Very cool, very cool. Um, let's see if there's more entries. Wow, we're getting a lot. Let me see this one as well. So Mike E. Cates did wow. Willie Nelson. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> nice. Um, yeah, wow. I like the font they choose. It's funny. Oh, that transition's cool too. Wow. About Willie. That's nice. Wow. Contact Willie. Yeah. How they maintain the like a branding, like different screen, you feel the same. The same look and feel. Yeah, the it? same look and feel and the same guy standing in all the pages. <laughs> Wow. No, this is cool. Yeah. I like it. Um, it's very like that country theme with the yeah. typeface they use and the photo that they have mm -mm. Uh, with, I guess, his music genre. Mm -mm. Um, let's look at about. Nice. It's like a very structured, like, yeah, basic the layout. Theme, yeah. With the header and the body. And I like how it shows the um, buy tickets or mm. the dates. Like on every page, I believe. Yeah. Because at the end of the day, you're trying to like get Buy money. Ticket. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Another DJ Paco. Why everyone is Paco? <laughs> is DJ are you, like? I mean, not DJ Paco. Are you a DJ? What? <laughs> what is happening? Today. <laughs> oh what? Howard, Howard says the template. Oh, he did. <laughs> nice. That's awesome. So, yeah. Uh, wow. Very colorful. Um, what do you think? Yeah, I think it's really it's the colors. True image, yeah. yeah, because it shows like a feel, mm, and the red color I really like the, like because it shoots for this theme. Which one? The red button, the buy ticket over here. Yeah, yeah. because it's go with the whole theme instead of white color button. Yeah, I like that too. Yeah, but I don't know the about the header. Go to the header. It's like a. I don't know. Oh, the opaque white. Yeah, it can yeah. be removed and like having maybe blood background. Yeah. Oh, wow. So this is, I guess, a different, like maybe on the iPad, so mm. responsive. Cool. Nice. And then mobile. Mm. Nice. They incorporated the red buttons. Mm. Very cool. Uh, any other feedback for in mobile? So, yeah, or just in general? Just yeah, to the, fix the the header. Yeah. That's the only thing. But otherwise, it just looks cool. Cool. Awesome. Um, let's see if the other ones popped. Ended up popping up. I know that we were having some problems. Let's see. Looks like the link got changed. Let's get rid of the ones that we already reviewed. Great submissions, you guys. These are yeah. looking great. DJ Paco. Awesome. Awesome. And then, oh, Hassan sent another one. I think the 
this is uploading. Hmm. Yeah, none of these are popping up. So, wow. yeah, I mean, thank you everybody for submitting. Mm -hmm. There's uh, hopefully Johnny Vino's feedback was good. Um, but yeah, do you want to show them really quickly, like what other uh, micro interactions you did or are doing today, or uh, you basically today finished? Yeah. Yeah, I'm basically finished. We can just interact in mobile. Yeah, you want to do it on the phone? Yeah. Yeah, let's so try that. that. Perfect. So we're giving you guys a live demo on the phone with the GoPro. That's cute. That's my friend. I know, I said the same thing. Cool. <laughs> and yes, Val, uh, if you didn't have time to submit your challenge submissions today, uh, join the XD Slack channel where they will, you know, let you know what the challenges are for the upcoming dates. Mm. Oh, we have XT Slack channel. I don't know. Yeah, we do. Yeah, I didn't know that either, but oh. it's um, I believe Adobe XD .slack .com, mm -hmm. and um, I think a moderator will, you know, put a link down there. So make sure to join. I'll show my cute thing. Oh my yeah! Look how cute. Okay, first of all, look how cute oh, that yeah, puppy yeah. is. <laughs> <laughs> oh it's my cute. god! Where did you get that? That is adorable. Uh, my friend Crystal gave me that. Oh, what is that? My friend. Oh, your friend gave it yeah, to you? Yeah, she's like really into cute stuff. That's awesome. Cool. So let's see. Okay, hope on this the is phone. going to work awesome. I'm going to drag here. Oh, nice. I'm going to select. Whoa. Whoa. I love it. <laughs> It's a rave on the phone. Oh, that's under 500, just like that. I'm gonna go down. Ooh, I love that. Mm. Oh, nice, so cool. cool. And it's just, it was such a simple way yeah. to um, do these micro interactions with mm -hmm. the animation tool. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. like a quick animate. Nice. Once you lay down everything, it's like, Everything is automated. I'm not playing with timeline. I'm not given anything. Yeah. It's like super quick. Quick, easy to use. Yeah. Uh, it's like anyone can understand. Okay, this is the concept I'm trying to convey. Mm -hmm. I can get feedback from anyone. It's, wow. Because since it's in the mobile, it's super quick. Okay. Oh, perfect. Oh, awesome. Thank you. Yay. Okay. Well, that was, that's amazing. Yeah. I'm like in shock because I learned some stuff and thank you uh, for teaching me these amazing things. Yeah. But um, really quickly, if we want to go back to my computer, we have the other submissions that we're not wow. loading that we just figured out. So thanks for tuning in with us still. Yeah. Um, so let's look at this one. Wow, this is crazy. I like the Havana. Do you, do you hear that song? <laughs> yeah. Oh, Havana. I don't want us to get copyrighted, okay. but um, I know I love that song too. So how do you feel about, oh, how do you feel about this hmm. website? I really like it. It's giving me like Spotify vibes, yeah. right? Like really cool. I like the theme, like it's a black theme. Like dark UI. Yeah, dark yeah. UI. Mm -hmm. Nice. It's, 
it's um I like how the photo kind of like blends in with the background, like right yeah. here, uh, with the smoke, like the purple smoke. Mm. Um, oh, that's cute. This little line interaction mm. to have the user scroll down. Um, I love how like the technically dark space, not white space, but like how it's very roomy, very nice. Yeah, and the spacing, the spacing and alignment is really clean. That makes like unique, I feel. Yeah. No. Beautiful. Uh, and then the video. Mm -hmm. Uh, the the use of like columns. Yeah, the separating. columns and mm -hmm. the. How do you feel about uh, like the albums being scattered? Yeah, stuff? I really like that. I don't mm -hmm. typically having like a card in a grid. It's yeah. like really like a smart idea, like mm -hmm. just laying out. Yeah, well done. Upcoming shows. Mm -hmm. Wow, you, they did a lot. <laughs> yeah, I think it looks like... This is amazing. I'm glad we got this to work. This is amazing. Yeah, I, f I feel like I am slow. They are so smart. <laughs> <laughs> wow, very cool. And showing the dates of the mm. shows, uh, the artists, the tickets, and then hovering over to mm -hmm. which ticket you want to get, city, um, and the time. You all shows. Wow, very clean, very minimalistic. Nice. The gradients are very cute it matches with the photos mm -mm -mm. um what would you how do you think about I, I believe this is like a music player yeah i don't know why it's maybe yeah it's, yeah i think it's like apple music you can buy this music i think that's oh, okay. really a smart idea yeah. because whenever i go to like some musician i want to buy stuff on their website right you know? right Oh, so maybe, is this a Lincoln Park or just, oh, it's an international festival, a music yeah. festival. Also, they oh. are linking the artist wow. songs. That's cool. Nice. Very cool. Also, instead of taking a blue, black, pure black, they uh -huh. choose pinkish dark. Yeah. Uh -huh. I like that. Yeah. I really like that. I like when, um, like being a photographer, like when artists do that, Yeah. they put that effect on photos. Uh, so, Ur Urbana, Urbana, popular singer artist. Okay, nice. Latest news. Mm. And then subscribe. Oh, so like the footer. Uh, I think one thing for me is I would like this image to be going down all the way, mm -mm -mm. and then get it getting rid of this like footer. Yeah, just that's kind the, of the subscribe button. Also, the overlay they put like a small. Yeah. That can be like opacity less. Mm -hmm. Or maybe a little pop of color with like yeah, a button. Yeah, that would this. be cool. That would be cool. Yeah. Um, but other than that, is it's there really anything cool. else you'd like to say? Like, would you, oh, maybe having this video bleed out in the corners, maybe? Yeah, video instead of having like a really rectangle, maybe something like tile alignment. Yeah. Like, what is the next video? That would be cool. Mm hmm. But I love the balance of like these bigger images with mm. these smaller ones. So great job. Nice. Um, so we have DJ Paco <laughs> where we can scroll down finally. Nice. Mm. About me. Nice. Very cool. Very simple and clean. Uh, albums, the circular. Mm. I like the cool subscribe. Which one? The under the subscribe button, there is like a with this one? Lighting. Like oh, in the, the background blur. Oh yeah, like the um, drop nice. shadow is actually a color drop shadow. Yeah, I love that when they did in Apple, like Apple Music, they have that. Yes. It's really cool. Uh, one thing I would say is um, have the consistency of, if you're gonna use sharp corners or round corners, like yeah. a circle, keep it consistent through the website, but overall it's very clean. Mm -mm. Um, nice large hero image. And do you have anything else to say about? Yeah. The thing you said is like the radius like they made in so many radius uh -huh. and font can be like instead of only black they can play around different like grayish tone because it's pure black now so they can play with the other colors would be cool wow yeah i agree nice like the color usage that yeah have. <laughs> uh oh here's another one this is by beck nelson mm -hmm. um Fat Freddy's Drop. <laughs> nice. What a name for a group. 
Uh, Event Finder New Zealand, I'm assuming. New Zealand. I like the purple, very bold purple. Purple. Um, with the special guests and the location. Also the golden buy tickets, it's like really big. It's like a, a CTA, <laughs> like buy tickets. Buy tickets. I wonder if there should be a CTA <laughs> for every section, like buy tickets, buy, buy tickets. tickets. Um, nice. I like uh, this bold purple. Mm -mm. Um, how do you feel about the light pink? Yeah, I think that's not merging with the whole theme. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? That is like a... Maybe a white background. Or, yeah. yeah. Also, there is like a kind of like a metro style. Like there is a bar on the top, then white, then purple. It can be same color. You know okay. what I mean? Yeah. If nice. they are maintaining a purple, can be the whole header can be purple. Mm -hmm. And then maybe having this uh, flush yeah, aligned with yeah. like this. Um, but I love the concept of using the rule of thirds where mm -hmm. they have the image and then Yeah, the that's text. cool. Buy ticket can be small. <laughs> Buy <laughs> tickets. Oh, you can actually... Oh, that's the interaction. Oh, wait, can you actually do interactions here? I should have like, looked at... But business people will love it if you put it. If I present to product manager. Oh wait, you can interact. Oh, wow. so many pages. Oh, it's, that's a cool feature. Oh, so he, oh, he made a whole PDF. Oh, he did a mobile app too. Oh, we missed wow. all this. Oh my God. So much work. Wow. Best TJ ever. Nice. <laughs> and then let me see, this was a PDF, mm -hmm. so I don't think. Cool. So let's say buy tickets, pop-up shows up, admission, Nice check out. Oh. oh wow, she did a whole like interaction so, with this. Very cool. But from business perspective, it's like really cool UX. Right? Get <laughs> the main theme of our website is to buy a ticket. <laughs> so it's like, come on, you <laughs> come guys on. have to buy this ticket. Cool. Oh my god, I love this. That's great. Is there any other interactions? Let's see. What's other directions? Nice. I'll click here for band profile. Also, a pop up with show. So, for the biography, how do you mm. feel about it? What do you think? Uh, biography, I feel it's. I like the interaction they have in the. Like a small button. It can be like the text can be bigger or like the line height. Mm -hmm. It can be improved. Or like heading section. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's my thing. I think whenever I see like a big content, I don't read. Yeah. <laughs> I'm yeah, too lazy, so if, yeah. if they like split into like different section. Mm -hmm. Like the rule of thirds, like yeah. how she did with this. Yeah, be... this one is cool. If they made in that structure, it would be nice with the images. And uh, scale yeah. for the text, yeah. I agree. Awesome job, Beck Nelson. And yeah, I think that's all the submissions we have for mm -hmm. today, you guys. You guys did amazing work. Great job. And uh we will, you know, see you guys tomorrow at yeah. 1 to 3 p.m. Thank you, Thank you. for an amazing <laughs> time today with my new friend, Johnny Vino. And yeah, we will see you tomorrow. Bye, everybody. Bye.